Hey there, gamers! Welcome back to Joystick News, your one-stop channel for all the latest in gaming news, reviews, and more. Today, we've got some exciting updates for all you PlayStation Plus subscribers out there. So grab your controllers and get ready, because July 16th is shaping up to be a big day. Alright, let's dive right in. PlayStation Plus subscribers, listen up. July 16th is a date you definitely want to circle on your calendars. Why, you ask? Well, it's not just about the usual free games update. This time, there are some extra juicy bonuses and potential game additions that you won't want to miss. Firstly, let's talk about the free games. Every month, PlayStation Plus treats us to a selection of games that we can download and play at no extra cost. But July 16th is not just any regular update. Sony has yet to officially announce the lineup, but the speculation and leaks suggest that we might be getting some real gems. I'm talking about potential blockbuster titles that could keep us all glued to our screens. Imagine getting your hands on a game like Resident Evil 4 Remake for free. That would be a huge win for horror fans and a perfect chance to dive back into the nightmare with enhanced graphics and gameplay. Or maybe we'll see Baldur's Gate, Enhanced Edition, which would be a dream come true for RPG enthusiasts. The possibilities are endless and that's what makes this so exciting. But that's not all. This month, there's an added bonus specifically for Genshin Impact players. Starting July 16th, PS Plus subscribers can claim 160 Primo Gems, 4 Fragile Resin, 20 Heroes Wit, 30 Mystic Enhancement Ore, and a whopping 150,000 Mora. If you're a Genshin Impact fan, you know how valuable these resources are. This is a great opportunity to boost your game without spending a dime. For those of you who might not be familiar, Genshin Impact is a massive open-world RPG developed by MiHoYo. It's known for its beautiful graphics, engaging story, and a wide variety of characters and abilities. These freebies from PS Plus can give you a significant advantage in the game, allowing you to level up your characters and gear more efficiently. So even if you're new to Genshin Impact, this is a fantastic time to jump in and start exploring the world of Teyvat. Now, let's speculate a bit on what games might be added to the PS Plus Extra and Premium tiers. While we don't have the official list yet, there are some strong contenders. Games like Resident Evil 4 Remake, Baldur's Gate, Enhanced Edition, and even some surprise indie hits could make the cut. These additions could provide hours of entertainment and might even introduce you to some new favorites. However, it's not all about what's coming. We also need to consider what might be leaving. Sony often rotates the game lineup, which means some titles will be removed from PS Plus Extra and Premium. If there's a game you've been meaning to play, now is the time to do it before it potentially disappears. This rotation keeps the service fresh and exciting, but it can also be a bit of a double-edged sword. On one hand, it's great to see new titles being added regularly, ensuring there's always something new to play. On the other hand, it can be a bummer when a game you've been eyeing suddenly gets removed. So my advice is to prioritize those must-play games before they're gone. So what does all this mean for you? Simple, make sure your PS Plus subscription is active, mark July 16th on your calendar, and be ready to dive into some new games and claim those sweet Genshin Impact freebies. It's going to be an exciting day and you don't want to miss out. Alright, that's all for today's update. What are your predictions for the new PS Plus games? Are you excited about the Genshin Impact bonuses? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update from Joystick News. Until next time, happy gaming!